Hi, Mike George from Martin here. I want to talk to you a little bit about some of our new X series. We basically completely uh, reimagined the line and what the specs are on them. And one in particular that I'd like to show you is our DX2E Brazilian. It's using actually a high quality scan of some primo stash of Brazilian that we have at the factory. Uh, so we went through dozens and dozens of sets to find the best possible pattern. And this model is featuring that pattern. So we have new patterns all around, uh, Brazilian, Cocobolo, and Ziracote, as well as quite a few playability upgrades, specifically around the neck. So we have a thinner fingerboard, which gives you just an overall better playing feel. We also tightened up the string spacing just a hair, refined it just a little, so that you get just the best possible playing experience. We're also now tailoring any guitar model that has a solid wood top with a solid fingerboard and neck. Satin tuners, satin strap buttons here for just an overall sleek look. And they're also featuring our proprietary Martin E1 electronics. So here we have an SC18E. We also have an SC28, similar build, just different appointments, obviously. So we came out with the SC a few years ago and the rallying cry has been, when are you gonna make an 18 and a 28? And that's what we have here. So Sitka spruce top, genuine mahogany back and sides, and all of the SC appointments that you're known to love. We strung this with Kovar strings, Kovar light, we felt it gave the best overall tone and playability. We equipped it with LR Bags Electronics. So here we have the GPCE Inception Maple, a really groundbreaking model for us. So this is in the GPC body shape, obviously, but we're using maple and walnut, as you can see on the back here, the walnut wedge. And we've really redesigned what a maple guitar should be. This is what we think a maple guitar should sound like. We've done that in a few ways. So under the hood here, we have skeletonized bracing. That's where you relieve some mass from the braces themselves, lightens up the overall system. You get more resonance, more bass response. And to add to that, to give a little more sustain as well, we've done sonic channeling around the bracing. So that's where you take a little bit of material around the bracing off of the top so it just again lightens up the system relieves some of the stiffness right at the point of the brace uh, still retaining structural integrity obviously but giving much more resonance this has a more bridge shape as you can see also in walnut but it's much sleeker sloped rather than the the hard edges that traditional guitars often have walnut inlay as you can see in our hex configuration and it's also featuring our new Amber Fade Burst on top, back, and sides. And that's kind of a unique thing for us. We typically do traditional bursts on the top, but this is all the way around.